Hey, 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 how are you? You know, I decided to put a dress on, remind me a little Florida living, honey, but I'm still Boston living, so yeah. Um, I went keep on shopping today, so I got um, three, well, six of these, um, a whole bunch of earrings, um, I think about 12 earrings, three nail polish for 32 cents, and then I also got five things of toothpaste. See, my closet's a little messy, but I got one, two, three, four, five, six. I think I spent on all those toothpaste about a dollar on six. Um, yeah, and then I got like body wash, and then I got this free with my coupons. Um, so, yeah, and I think I got this for a dollar at CVS, so I did really good couponing today. It's been like two dollars. <laughs> so, yeah, um, I have done a, um, marriage board, and I did it in the spirit of Valentine's Day, um, so... Um, it's about love and how um, love is an action and so uh, my marriage board is called the acts of love so I'm gonna show you guys my marriage board okay so here it is I'm in the bathroom you guys so um, yeah so I know you guys hear the thing in the background so it says acts of love. So an act is to behave in a way specified and uh, to take action to do something. So love is an action. Um, and when you love, you must be, um, you must act out of love. And um, so the question is, is what are loving actions? So what is a loving action? Um, in the Bible, they have 1 Corinthians 13. And 1 Corinthians 13 talks about the acts of love. Um, basically talking about how to behave in a loving manner. Uh, so I put down 1 Corinthians 13. Um, but one thing I want to talk about how love is an action. In John 3.16, the Bible says, For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in him should not perish but have everlasting life. That means God made a sacrifice. Sacrifice is part of loving. If you do not make any type of sacrifice in uh, love, you are not acting in love. Because love, the one of the biggest part of love is sacrificing. Um, and so, I'm going to show you some acts of love that the Bible states, okay? Um, so, some of the acts of love. It says, love is patient. Uh, you can find this in 1 Corinthians 13. Uh, love is patient, kind, not envious, not rude, not selfish, not easy angered. Uh, enjoys the truth, bears all things, hopes all things, and endures all things, okay? Um, I once did a video before. Um, and it talks about how God loves me every single day. Um, and so, at the bottom of my marriage board, um, it says that acts of love are made daily. So, acts of love are made daily. And love is not just one day out of the year, okay? Valentine's Day, maybe today, woohoo, that's great. But if... You're only showing love on this day, then you got life all wrong. You know, if you're only showing love on your wedding day, you got love all wrong. If you're only showing love when you first start dating your man, your 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 woman, your spouse, you know, you got love all wrong. Cause love is every single day. You have to keep working uh, to love someone. If you're only showing your children love once in a blue moon, you got love all wrong. Love is every single day. Um, I was actually having a conversation this morning and talking about how different people grow up in different households and they learn love in, in different types of ways and manners. And some people don't even know how to love. And so this is kind of to explain that when you love, you have to love with action, you know? Like, you can't just say, you know, for years and years and years I heard, oh, I love you, Jasmine, but that was words. It wasn't action. You know, you can say you love me all day, but if you're not acting in love, if you're not, 
you know, giving me the love that I deserve. You know, God says he loves me. He acted in love by giving his son to die on the cross for me. He acted in love. He gave. You know, he made a sacrifice. He made an action of love. So, love is every single day, you know. Love is every single day, you know. Whether it's going to work, providing for your kids, uh, going to work, making sure that your bills are paid for you and your spouse. Um, whether it is... Uh, giving up something that you so desire to do something else. I live in Massachusetts. I hate it here. It's, you know, like, but I'm sacrificing this because this is what my husband likes. You know, this is a sacrifice. So, for me, like, it's big because I don't like it, you know, but I do it because this is what he likes, you know. And so, in order to say that you love someone, uh, you must act in love. You must make sacrifices. You know, love is an action. Are you patient? Are you kind? Are you not envious or rude? You know, how how is your attitude? Um, are you not selfish? You know, a lot of people, um, you know, I remember being younger and wanting love, you know, and so what you end up doing is you take, 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 take love and you suck it out of other people because you're wanting it so much but you never give it back. You know, love is about giving to someone else and, you know, some people are so selfish that all they do is take, 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 take and they're not giving any kind of love back, you know. Some people don't even know love or know how to give love that because they're lacking in so much love and understanding of love that that's all they know how to do. I remember at one point that's all I knew how to do was you know take 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 love from other people because I was lacking in love. You know, so love is an action. I know that you know someone pouring love into me, you know, uh, caused me to want to learn how to love. Caused me to want to not be so selfish and when it came to loving people and you know um, and understanding that love was real um, you know for me it was when me and Deshaun were younger and he gave me the time that I needed for me love was taking the time it was an act of love you know acting give me the time of day you know uh, so you have like love is not easily angered it enjoys the truth um, it bears all things love is not easy because bearing all things is not easy because it comes with, you know, like with when you get married, uh, for better or worse, you know, like marriage is not all for better, <laughs> it's for worse, for sickness and in health. I did the video um, uh, for sickness and health, you know, um, Deshaun had the flu, you know, like, uh, no, he had pneumonia and I was up all night long like waiting for him to want to go to the hospital and making soup and running to the store and you know like you happen to miss work and I was just tired I was exhausted I was drained but I still made the sacrifice to make sure that he felt better um let's see love bears all things hopes all things you know um you hope that things are going to be good you know you hope that things are uh, you know, like, for instance, I look at my grandmother and her type of love, you know, she could have gave up on me. I was an out-of-control teenager, but she didn't. She kept praying for me. She kept loving me. She kept doing what she had to do for me until I got the picture. I understand that, you know, I needed to change my life. And she, she hoped, she hoped, you know, she hoped that things would get better for me, that my life would change, you know. Um, and she endured, endured all things, you know. Through the cutting, through the hospital visits, through the lockup, through the jail, through all that stuff. She did she endured, you know, it wasn't easy. So love, acts of love are made daily. Whether it is making a meal, washing the dishes, uh, doing laundry, going to work, paying bills, um, making sure you're providing for your family, giving hugs, giving love, uh, you know, putting up with people's stuff. Because people have a lot of mess going on with them. You know, that that's life. Everybody has a problem, an issue, something. Enduring through whatever issues that they have to go through. Whatever problems that they are struggling with. Whatever sicknesses. Um, whatever, whatever life comes with when it comes to whoever you're loving. Uh, so, uh, yeah. That is my um, lesson of acts of love. And, um... 
Hope you guys got something out of it. I am actually going to go eat my brownies because I just made brownies um, for one of my clients and at work. And I've realized that, well, for a long time, my grandma has allowed me to know that when you make a promise to someone, you better keep it. And so that's what <laughs> I did. I told her that I'd make her some brownies, and so that's what I did. Um, even being tired and all, you, you still got to do what you, you got to do. You know, you got to be a person to be worried. So I love you guys so much. Until we meet again, God bless. Peace.